Hello everyone, welcome to the session. In this session, we are going to see few non-printable characters. These are also known as non-visual characters. And these are carriage return CR, line feed, carriage return and line feed CRLF. These characters are not printable or not visible in the computer. But these are used to perform some action like adding the enter or new line in the text so these characters do not have any symbol that's why these are not printable or not visible but these characters are used to change the look or the format of the text first is the carriage written cr it is used to move the cursor to the beginning of the line without advancing or going to the next line so this character works in the same line this came from carriage mechanism inside a typewriter ascii code is 0d in hexa lifeline or lf this is used to move the cursor down to the next line without returning to the beginning of the line ascii code is 0a in hexa different operating system uses these characters differently to perform some action these are the known as new line characters these characters are used to mark a line break in the text file in windows crlf is used as a new line character the ascii code is 0d 0a in linux or unix the line feed lf is used as a new line character in the mac operating system in mac os x the lf is used as a new line character and in old mac operating system cr was used as a new line character let me explain with the help of example while writing a text in any editor text editor when you press the enter the new line character is added at the end of the line if you press enter in the windows system crlf is added at the end of the line if you press enter in the linux or mac operating system lf is added at the end of the line so these characters are used to perform the new line action in the text file different operating system uses these characters carriage return and line feed to give the line break that's why these are known as the new line characters end of the line characters now let's see how to check which new line character whether the crlf is present or its lf present as a new line or its cr present in the text file so we have notepad plus plus there is one feature available you can use that we will see we will see how to check which new line character is present in the file so what you need to do is you need to open your text file in the notepad plus plus and you need to go to the view and you need to click on the so symbol and you need to click on the so end of line so if you see again it will be ticked enabled so end of line so this option is used to display the end of line character or new line character present in the file you can see there is one new line present in my text file and it has highlighted that crlf since my system is windows so the new line character is crlf in windows so if you write anything in this file and add the new line so how to add new line just by entering the enter key so enter key is used to give the new line to disable it you need to click on the again so end of line so you can see the new line characters are not getting displayed in the file suppose somebody has sent you the file which has been generated in the linux system but you have the windows operating system you can also see the new line character present in the unix open that file 
the same way we have done for this test.txt so this is how you can check which new line character present in your file there is one more point i have mentioned here how to deal when transfer file among system different system you have seen in the previous slides that different operating system has a different new line character so suppose you have created the file in the windows operating system and and you are opening in the linux the same file since you have created the file in the windows operating system it will use the new line character of the windows operating system crlf and if you are opening the file in linux operating system there might be a possibility that a particular text editor is not able to interpret your file crlf that's why one point i want to highlight is in past many problems were faced when transferring text files between different operating systems and because software text editor were not smart enough to detect the line break the new line line break is also known as new line style used by a file for example if if you open an unix file in microsoft notepad it will display the text as if the file contained a no line break so basically it would it would remove the line breaks from the file nowadays software text editor are smart enough to display the file correctly in a different platform in different operating system you might face problems related to neural characters when transfer file from one system to another so we should be careful whenever we deal with data transfer between different platforms manually or using application we should transfer it through proper software like ftp server to avoid any kind of issue that's all for this session thanks for watching see you in the next video